Hello and welcome to the introduction of the Civic Action Scorecard, where we act with purpose and score with impact. The Civic Action Scorecard is an online toolkit that the Office for Community Engaged Learning is using in order to promote civic engagement amongst SRU students. We define civic actions as an action that has a measurable impact on a society, a community, or its community members. The Civic Action Scorecard allows students to take ownership over their involvement in the community while earning awards to recognize their achievements. Why is the Civic Action Scorecard important at SRU? The Office for Community Engaged Learning provided the Civic Action Scorecard as an online tool for faculty and staff to empower their students to be civically engaged while motivating students to act on and benefit from that learning experience. I'm sure you're wondering how does it even work? And depending on how you use the scorecard, you can achieve all 10 SRU undergraduate university-wide outcomes and with over 125 equitable, accessible, and diverse civic involvement opportunities, you can customize the civic actions to fit your course objectives. The functionality of the scorecard ensures that anyone and everyone can use it. Help students find their cause or connect them to the public purpose of your course with any of the six categories. Whether it be arts and cultures or democratic citizenship, there is something to encourage everyone to be civically engaged. Take action, gain points, and earn awards. Do you like environmental sustainability and community well-being? Now your students can get an award in both. Students can select and customize their awards to their interests. Awards are separated by a 100 point value difference into three categories, bronze, silver, and gold. Awards allow students to be recognized for their civic action achievements, and reflections help students make meaning out of their experiences. Badges earned by students provide a talking point about their civic engagement in the community and is a great asset to have while talking to employers or graduate schools. Students can earn awards with three steps. During the action, documenting that they've done said action with a photograph or physical document, and then reflecting on their experience of completing that action using the minimum standards provided by your professor or on our website. One of the most intriguing features about the scorecard is that it's flexible to your course. Professors can customize the scorecard by assigning students specific actions or leaving it up to the students. Professors will be able to verify their students' action through their own personal portal. Student clubs and organizations can bring additional value to things that they might already be doing. And lastly, if you have an idea that's not represented on the civic action list, you can add your own through the Propose Your Own feature. If you haven't done so already, check out the full civic action list to see what aligns with your course objectives. Next. If you're interested, contact our OCEL director, Jeffrey Rathliff, to discuss options for your course. Then, we'll set you up with a 30-minute orientation on the functionality of the scorecard, accessing your portal, and how to verify civic action impacts from your students. Lastly, we will come to your class, make a video, or host a Zoom meeting in order to orient your students with a step-by-step -step guide on how to complete the civic actions, request for verification, and answer any questions that your students might have in order to ensure their success. For inquiries or next steps, contact the Office for Community Engaged Learning or the Civic Action Coordinators at civicaction.sru.edu. Thanks for watching and go check out the scorecard.